Warwick man known for his work as an NBA skills trainer is in police custody tonight after being accused of rape in Boston. Robert McClanahan was ordered to be held until Boston police can pick him up. His first court appearance was in Warwick today, and that's where we find 12 News reporter Sheena Loschuto, who has the latest on the investigation. Well, a lot of the new details we're getting on this case is coming straight from Boston police. And in light of this arrest, the department there is urging everyone to be careful when they go out. We have attorneys arranged up there. He's worked with some of the most famous names on the world's biggest basketball stage. Now, Robert McClanahan is facing felony charges, accused of raping a woman in Boston earlier this month. A Boston police report says he was captured on video, sprinkling something into the woman's drink. Uh, Boston said they can be here within five days. Probably the charges are out of Boston, but Warwick police brought the Rhode Islander into custody. That's why McClanahan is being arraigned as a fugitive of justice at Kent County Court. It's unclear when the basketball skills trainer will face a judge in a Massachusetts courtroom. The victim in this case told Boston police she woke up to sign she was sexually abused. According to the police report, she told police she doesn't remember much else. And I ended up coaching here, teaching here. This is all 12 News video. The skills trainer is a graduate of Bishop Hendrickson and also worked at basketball camps there. He's most known, however, for his work with NBA athletes like LeBron. LeBron James and Steph Curry. In the wake of his arrest, Boston police are urging people to be safe, encouraging a buddy system when you go out. Authorities are sharing these tips, emphasizing you should never take your eyes off of your drink. And McClanahan has hired a Rhode Island based attorney. We did try speaking with him after the arraignment today, but he told us he has nothing to say on behalf of his client. Reporting live in Warwick, I'm Sheena Loshudo, 12 News. Tonight, a Warwick man who worked with some of the top NBA players will remain in jail until Massachusetts authorities pick him up. Robert McClanahan appeared in Kent County Court this morning after police in Boston charged him with rape. 12 News reporter Sheena Loshudo joins us now live from Warwick with what she's learned about the prominent basketball trainer. Well, a lot of the new information we're getting tonight is from Boston police because authorities say this happened in the city of Boston. However, authorities in Warwick picked McClanahan up. That's why he was arraigned here first. In handcuffs and escorted out, 43-year-old Robert McClanahan has his first court appearance. The prominent basketball skills trainer is being accused of raping a woman, slipping something into her drink first. A Boston police report states the incident happened on the night of the 3rd at a Boston hotel. McClanahan and the woman made plans to meet there, had some drinks, and then decided to go to her hotel room. According to the police report, that's the last thing the victim says she she remembers before waking up to signs she was sexually assaulted. Police say the victim went to the hospital and then detectives got to work finding surveillance video of what appears to be McClanahan sprinkling something into the women's drink. Police in Warwick arrested McClanahan on Friday and today he's being arraigned as a fugitive of justice. I wear my basketball journey, you know, started. This is 12 news video from a few years ago. McClanahan used to work at Bishop Hendrickson in high school and has worked with top NBA stars as a skills trainer. He's very well known in the basketball community. Nothing at all about your client? No, nothing. McClanahan's lawyer had nothing to say when we tried asking him questions. He's represented by local attorney Daniel Griffin. It's unclear when the trainer will answer to those rape charges in a Massachusetts courtroom. Now, in light of this recent arrest, Boston police are reminding people to just be careful when you go out, encouraging people to use the buddy system and a reminder to never take your eyes off of your own drink. Reporting live in Warwick tonight, I'm Sheena Loshudo, 12 News.